Certified San Diego's most accurate forecast. This is a 10 News breaking weather alert. Indeed it is. 10 News Pinpoint Meteorologist Craig Herrera tracking uh, when we are about to get slammed tomorrow. Yeah, exactly. You saw the effects on the Bay Area. Boy, we're going to have some serious stuff here as well, including showers, thunderstorms, small hail and lightning and low snow levels. Boy, El Nino is back right after taking all of February off. Look at this gorgeous shot right now. Look at it, Carlsbad. Nice sunset clear. The calm between the two storms and the second one. Boy, it's a powerful one. The winds are a story for us tonight as we look at a nice good old American flag blowing in the wind and it continues to be a story for us tomorrow. We're at 62 at Lindbergh. Northwest winds at eight miles per hour and humidity at 58% around the rest of the county. We're already down to 35 at Mount Laguna. So this higher elevations are going to get very cold tomorrow and snow will come in. Usually comes in during the overnight hours. Tomorrow we'll see it during the afternoon. The winds right now out of the west southwest sustained 10 at Kearney Mesa, 22 Borrego Springs, uh, Chula Vista at three and six at Carlsbad. Let's go with wind gust future cast and I'm starting at three o'clock in the morning. Notice 24 Julian, 43 Ocotillo Wells, 15 Kearney Mesa during the afternoon. Look at that. Some strong winds from Poway to Ramona, 34, 38 El Cajon, 38 Chula Vista, 27 Escondido, 27 as well. So a gusty winds at times tomorrow afternoon as far as that's when the frontal system will pass. Now the waves are another big story for us. Very big sets. Eight feet now to the south end of the county tomorrow getting up to 15 feet. And again, a reminder, the water temperatures are still very warm, 63 degrees or so. Here's the system right now passing into the Bay Area. The storm door is open. This is colder shower or colder storm. So isolated thunderstorms and snow dropping down to 4000 feet. A stormy morning. The morning commute tomorrow off and on scattered rain showers. I think the frontal system itself passes during about 10 in the morning to about two in the afternoon. Again, surf up to 14 feet and some small hail and lightning with the system. Rain future cast 1230 tomorrow or in the morning, you know, scattered and very light. Eight o'clock, you can see some scattered showers west of the mountains. That's the frontal system right there. Watch as we go through 10, 11 o'clock, 11 o'clock. You're seeing some heavy rains, Santee, Chula Vista, and I think we can see some embedded showers and thunderstorms there as well as snow for the higher elevations. That's 1030 in the morning. This thing passes by the time we get into the evening commute. Most of this is gone 3 p.m. I mean, this could all change. Most of this is all gone. A few scattered showers about 730 in the evening, and then this thing is out of here by midnight. So it's a fast moving storm. After that, we can say whew, at least until Friday. The next storm comes in on Friday. All right, rain future cast. This is going into Tuesday. Poway up to an inch of rain at Chula Vista. The same Julian a little over an inch and a quarter, about an inch and a half from Mount Laguna uh, along the coast, anywhere from half an inch to about an inch and a half. Tonight we drop to 33 Julian, 27 Mount Laguna, 43 El Cajon, Chula Vista, 47. Your extended forecast at the coast, only 58 for a high along the coast. Now our temperatures tomorrow are pretty uniform from the coast to the inland communities. On Tuesday, we get sunshine. We're back up to 62. We stay sunny and warm Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, and then another week system comes in on Saturday. Gives us a chance for a few more showers, another quarter of an inch to half an inch, so not powerful like we're getting today. Showers and thunderstorms again, only 59 for a high tomorrow inland. Look at that, we're back up to 70 on Tuesday, 75 on Wednesday, 76 on Thursday. It's like nothing happened at all, right? 42 for the mountains tomorrow, 58 for the deserts. So, Rio, we should get some good rainfall with this one. Again, it's a fast moving system, the one Friday, not so much, yes. but boy, good. So mostly in the morning, in the midday, and yeah. then and then and then scattered and isolated for the commute home. Not as strong. Okay, yeah. great. Good Thanks timing. <laughs>